Okay, another problem that a lot of people have setting up the Prophecy is their COM ports. Unless your computer has a COM port built into it, you have to do a little bit of work. You get a USB to serial converter, much like the one here as shown. Biggest problem you need to do is make sure that the driver for this converter works with your operating system. For instance, if you get a converter that says it works with Windows Vista, but you're running Windows 7, you're going to have a bit of a problem and it's going to be hit or miss whether it will work or not. So make sure that the converter, first of all, will work with your operating system. Next thing you do is you need to install the driver. A lot of them come with uh, CDs that require you to load the driver. Not all of them have their drivers built into them. So check, make sure, see if you have a CD and load the driver. Once that's taken care of, plug the, uh, plug the adapter into your USB port. You'll hear Windows go through loading it. You'll see some loading messages. And then you'll want to find out what COM port it has been assigned to. So to do that, you come over here, bring up Control Panel. And you'll want to find the uh, Device Manager. So I have Device Manager right here. Your window may look different. Whatever way your window looks, you'll need to find the Device Manager. Usually it's under a System tab. So we'll go over here to Device Manager, bring that up. Okay, and here comes the Device Manager and it will list up all the devices. Mine's taking a little bit of a while. Now you look over here and you'll see COM port, C, ports, COM and LPT, COM ports. If I look down here, I see Communications Port COM1. Intel Active Management Te Technology COM3. Okay, and I know that from before working on this that my new COM port is on COM1, so I will write that down. That's the COM number that I need. Okay, so I can come back over here, close the Device Manager, close this window, now come back to Prophecy, and I'm going to right click on the target and look for Properties. Okay, Come down here to Physical Port. I see I'm set to COM4. I want to change that to COM1. Okay. And now to test this, I want to go online with Target 1. Okay. It starts up. Connecting. You should see the little scroll bar go by once or twice. And then you'll see Monitor. You can connect it. And you are now connected to the device. That's all you have to do.